I converted the grass strip out front of my house into a native wildflower micro meadow. And one comment I get pretty often is, yeah, it looks great during the summer, but how bad does it look during the fall and winter time? So here's what it looks like during the off season. It may not look like much with these dead and dormant plants, but let's take a closer look at what's happening. These woodland sunflower seed heads are like a winter bird feeder. These seeds will help the native birds get through the winter. And same thing for these New England asters and these Joe pie weeds. Also, these standing dead stems are very important for our native bees who hibernate inside the hollow stems over the winter. And there are probably a few hundred of these stems throughout my garden. Lastly, the stems catch and hold leaf litter on the ground all winter, even when it's windy, which provides great overwintering habitat for insects like butterflies, moths, and lightning bugs. So even though they may not look very attractive in the winter, native gardens are still providing essential services to wildlife and to the ecosystem. And to be honest, a lot of the turf lawns around me don't look that great during the winter either, and they provide none of these benefits.